Hey, this is Spencer of Redow Productions, and we're currently standing at Patriot Park in Stoystown, Pennsylvania. Longtime viewers of the channel may recall us stopping here on an earlier edition of Retrace in History when we were exploring memorials surrounding the Flight 93 crash site. And Patriot Park has always had a special place in my heart. The first time I visited this, I didn't know what to expect. It just recently opened. A lot of the signage was ba very basic and bare bones. I walk back though, and I see that field of flags, what they call the field of honor. Over 7,000 American flags are planted by volunteers here at the start of spring and here through fall to commemorate the 7,000 American servicemen and women that were killed in the global war on terror. Now, this is a very recent event that you could even argue in some ways is still ongoing and maybe something people don't want to talk too much about, but it is one day going to be a historic event that we will have to educate future generations about. And I feel feel that this, the organization behind Patriot Park, the Patriot Park Foundation, they are a fantastic entity to provide an historical education of the global war on terror. Uh, they're constantly trying to make updates to the site to prepare it for a permanent memorial. However, they have tweaked their plans. They are now going to include the field of honor that was not initially in the plans, but it's been so awe-inspiring for travelers who stop and pay their respects here. That it's going to be in the final plan. I know they're also planning to get an education facility on the grounds, a permanent wall of names of each of the 7,000 servicemen and women killed in the war on terror, and they're going to really do a lot of good on this site. So please consider going to their website and checking out how you can support making Patriot Park a permanent site to commemorate and educate about the global war on terror in the history of the United States of America.